The Denny J Show. That's us? That's us. I had to do it, otherwise it was going to go on. And on and on and on. And on. Oh, yes. Oh, people are very happy, eh? <laughs> What's going on, Becky K? I'm good, Danny. How are you? Nash. What's we good, Danny? We're good. We're chilling. What's happening today? Sissy Bekina. I'm the same comma Nesh. Mabunzi Babaja again. That's right. Mm-hmm. Got to put some respect on it. Yes, I'm putting some respect uh, on it. Yes, Makadi Nengi Babaja. Yeah, we're good. This is Bekina. What? <laughs> hey, yo, these lights are. What's your heart? Yo, Mawan. Mawan. Okay. Peace, Samu. Peace. Yeah, those who Summer. are watching True Kumbero Aircon. Mm, some are producers. We need aircon. Hey, Jololo. Pro, pro A. A. Yeah, let's get let's get some pro some A. A. Oh, speaking of of Pro A, Pro A would fall under like a corporate <coughs> company, right? Uh, you, yes, yes. Yeah. It's it, it's a corporate. Mm-hmm. It's not a MCMA type of business. Thing. Well, it's proper. It's a proper. It's company. proper. Yeah. So there's a comment <coughs> on YouTube. <laughs> Someone is very worried about Danny J. <laughs> Yeah, hey, sh- they sweating too much. <laughs> yeah, I know. Hey, someone I know. is I'm nervous. I must be nervous. Are you alright? I don't know. It must be. It must right. be what I'm about to say. Alright. It must be what I'm about Young to say. Don't get right, put. No, I'm good. I'm good. All right. I'm good. So there's a comment. I yeah. hope I find it fast enough. Um, but it has to do with uh, getting sponsorship for the show, uh, from corporates and everything. But there's always, and there's always like alcohol, yep. in front of Danny. Yep. <laughs> and they were wondering how yeah. are corporates going to like come on board to support when um, Danny is uh, supporting or advocating for alcoholism? Yes, and uh, isn't mm. Delta a corporate? That's what I thought. Delta is a corporate, yes, definitely. Uh, and what's that uh, Red Bull brew distribution under corporate? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. yeah. So, you know, if we do a lot of liquor, mm-hmm. the liquor companies should be able to. So, y- you're not saying, Wawa Pamberi, you're just like, hey, this yeah, is. No, no, yeah. Because, cause, you know, I, I think a lot of people have their opinions about how the show should go. Uh, yeah, why definitely. are you doing this? You're supporting alcoholism or whatever. You, wanna, you know, people don't have to watch our show. Uh, but we're okay, not so just say I'm not supporting alcoholism and we're just, you know, you're yeah, just yeah, like yeah, chilling. No. Yeah, people drink, you know, just like how you have ads of people drinking and stuff. It's, mm-hmm. it's so normal. Uh, we're not that kind of show. That's why we have the 18 in, in, in the corner. Okay. Every time we're showing our show. Mm-hmm. It's not just for sensitive people. Something. It's not okay. for... And you know, some people are also also have a problem with us, you know, uh, using swear words at times. Yeah, but we're just that kind of show, you know. We we're so cool, and we can pretty much do what we want. Yeah, um, and, and that's our appeal. I guess if you're sensitive, this is not the type of show to watch. Yeah, you know, we've got other podcasts. Otherwise, you catch feelings. Yeah, yeah, but I want to catch up my feelings because we can just say "fuck you" from Norway. <laughs> You know, <laughs> bitch <laughs> from Norway. Oh. You know, uh, oh. I will fuck your bitch <laughs> from Norway. Oh, right? yes. We can say that, yeah. I mean, right? Oh I, I, I mean, we're not we're not as extra as <laughs> No, no, but I'm just saying is no. What I'm saying is we can say things like that here, we would, right? We, but if you're if you're if you're gonna be sensitive, <laughs> maybe this for is not, example, yeah, this is not the type of show to watch. Okay. Yeah, wow, that's heavy. That's heavy. That was we, heavy. We usually don't say it like that, that tra- but I think he was just making it. No, no, I'm just trying to make it because this is not the type of show. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay. This is this is not the show. It's not family viewing. Yeah, we, we could yeah. say you know we swear mm. you know here and there, but you it know, is this not is for family viewing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but we're, we're pretty good sure. people. But but if we get a, a like a big corporate sponsor wants us to to slow down on that a little bit, yeah, will we, we, we stop, Nash? I or don't think that so. No, the show, no, right? they change the show. Oh, okay, so. We we don't want to be controlled. Once we're being controlled. Yeah, my Chisamba. This yeah, yeah, yeah. We we are referring Ooh. these corporates to my Chisamba. Oh, you know what I mean. The, she's gonna show. Okay. Yeah, they'll love it. So um, yeah. Speaking of being sensitive, jeez, actually. I know. I'm just saying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is well. Wow. It is oh. well. So back to the oh, comment it's section. It's getting hot in here, though. <laughs> I mean, yes. It was hot. To, to the well, left. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. got it. Yeah. Okay. There we go. I'm good. Uh huh. Um. So the the comment section on YouTube was hey okay. <laughs> the comment section. So it's not just me. It, it is. No, it's hot. not just you. It, okay. It's it's quite hard. And then yeah. yeah. Um, the comment section on YouTube for the, our last episode. Mm. Yeah, Sandra Ndeveli. Yeah. Megu less into esning. 
I got this corner corner pana ne. So titles. I'll, yeah. I'll start off with um I'll start off with what stood out for me yeah. and then you can let me know what stood out for you. Yeah. First of all, somebody thinks I have something or a problem with Gorumunz. I don't have a problem with Gorumunz in high school. Danny, do I have a problem with Gorumunz? Uh, no, 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 she doesn't. I think maybe the context. Maybe Thank they didn't you. watch they didn't, they didn't watch, the, watch previous, the previous ones. Yeah, so it kind of like came out. Yes, like, I have I don't even know where Gorumunz High School is. It's just that it resonates with yeah. Danny. But yeah. he went to George's after that. So. No, <laughs> John's. Oh, John's. Oh, John's. No. oh, sorry, John's. Oh, look at me going again. Come okay, on now. Jo- yeah. He went to John's. Jo- mm. jo- Jones. John's. Yeah, so I think the illustration John's. was there's a difference, you know, between yes. St. John's and Goromonzi. It's undoubted. Yes. There's a difference. Yes, but not that I've got anything against Yeah. I can say. And yeah. then you made some friends. Uh, yes. Mm. Yes, yes, I did. Um, specifically a joyful, but her message wasn't very joyful, though. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, joyful! Um, was commenting about you, the statement you made about Mina Losandro to be school my and then you said, mm. "I hope you won't like continue yeah. with this whole Ndebele thing." Like we we got you, yeah. I got you, yeah. But oh, lo la lo la lo la lo. Mm-hmm. What did they say? Uh, I think we'll have uh, uh, the production team put up a clip. Yeah, of, they, of what I said. They didn't got you. Yeah. Um, Danny, I love how open-minded you are, but we need to be careful on the issues of language. Saying "leave me out of it" when speaking Isindebele did not sound right, no matter how hard you try to justify it. You will not understand it, Wena Ngoba. I will come marginalized, Wena. Right? It is now. So, so, so do, do do we respond one one because no, no, no. this okay. is one message. I, I don't know. Do, do, I'll yeah. just read two, then you can let me know if you want to just respond to um, both yeah, of them. Yeah. Uh, okay. It is known that you guys expect us to understand Shona. Godwalina. You do not even try to understand a bit. Yes, some of it. You were simply making fun, but Ogunyen Dota. I'll see Shoni Pang. Okay. Um <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'll see Pang as he sees the Saman Devele. Please be careful next time. What do I mean from today? I lost all respect for you, man. I've yeah. been following the show. What are today? What does that mean? So yeah. it, who, who's this? Um, joyful movie. So she's just saying your your comment. Yes, you may have been making fun, but what was I making fun? No, no, you're not making fun. I, I wouldn't you, say. Yeah, uh, I I think for those who didn't watch the clip, the guys are going to put it up. Okay. All right. La, okay. La, la, la Pathfinder. Subtitles. <laughs> subtitles. <laughs> wow. Okay. I yes. didn't know that. That's good. By the time when I left, I was now a counselor. Single youth, single graduate. Oh, I left. It's the young court. Mm. Becky, you just <laughs> brought us out of the internet. Okay, sorry. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> what did we talk about? <laughs> no, no, she was <laughs> just truly <laughs> expressing like, the well, fact all that. I, all she, I was saying is from uh, when Sandra and Debele walked in, uh, they were talking Debele with Becky because Becky speaks fluent Debele, right? So that's cool. And then, so as soon as the cameras went on, uh, I was like, I hope you're not going to speak Debele. Clearly referring to the fact that I can't speak Debele. And you'll be left out of the conversation. I'll be left out of the conversation. And it is the Danny J show. It helps when Danny J knows what we're talking about, isn't it? Thank you. You understand what I'm saying? So so people who came out and saw that as something else, uh, I think those people might actually have a problem themselves. Because... But even if it was a Chinese person that we had brought in, Mm -hmm. and he started speaking Chinese, I was going to say to him, I hope you won't speak Chinese. Not that I have a problem with Chinese people. But just don't leave me out. I can't speak Chinese. You understand what I'm saying? So it's the same with Debele or any other language. If we had a Tonga guy, I was probably going to say, I hope you're not going to speak Tonga. You understand what I'm saying? So if somebody then takes that to say Danny J is tribalistic, that person probably... Probably has a tribal problem of their own yeah. because you see how it how it works out. Yeah, they're definitely projecting. Yes, there are, pe- there are people who have certain sensitivities, and then when someone says something, they're ready to pounce and and take it to be something it's not. You understand? Why would I have a problem with Tebele people? It doesn't make sense. You know, I, mean, I, did, I didn't grow up in an era where they, we were we were taught hate. I love a lot of my friends at Tebele. We love Ndebele women. And Ndebele women are some of the Ndebele best women, women have we have given in the country. Us the best bodies on earth. You understand what I'm saying? Why so, would we hate Ndebele people? So when someone threatens and say, Danny J, you got to apologize to all Ndebele people. I'm not apologizing shit. 
For we because we don't we don't apologize just, in the show. Yeah, I if you want to apologize, my just stand by your tower. Yes, that's where you go to. And I say this, Marco, yeah. you must put. Uh, in addition to the disclaimer we have, we must put another one, not for sensitive viewers. Because yeah. if you're gonna have a problem with me saying you uh, uh, please don't speak Tonga on the show because Danny J doesn't speak Tonga, then you have a problem with me. Yeah. You have a problem with the show. And look. We like people to watch our show. Yeah, we you understand. Yeah. We're not but we're not arrogant like that. But what I'm saying is, don't come and lecture me about being a tribalist because I've never been tribal we, to anyone. Oh, we love Ndebele women. You understand what I'm saying? The emphasis, yeah, is we love. So that Ndebele. apology you're waiting for, my brother, is not coming. You might as well just watch another show because I will not apologize Ooh. unless I did something wrong. Yes, I just say don't speak Ndebele. I didn't even say don't speak Ndebele. I said I hope you're not going to speak Ndebele. And if you're going to speak, you're going to speak a little. You understand? Yeah, yes. Because yes. if I say something to Sandra, for example. And she answers me in Tebele. I can't do a follow-up question because I don't know what she said. So yeah. what's the point of the interview if I don't understand the guest? You understand? So yeah. whoever has a tribal problem who thinks I'm, I'm a tribalist probably are tribal themselves. You understand what I'm saying? I hate to put it like this, but uh, I, I was actually pissed off by the whole thing because people made a big deal of me saying I don't speak in Tebele, so therefore let's just speak a language which everybody un understands. Okay, and then there's those people, Dan, who yeah. um, grew up as Ujoyful said, marginalized, yep. right? Mm -hmm. um, and it's because the Ndebele in Zimbabwe are the minority. So right. obviously they are going to be marginalized. Right. The same way black people were marginalized, so mm -hmm. we always feel a certain way when a white man um, really? feels like they've got a right to do something or even a parking slot. Mm -hmm. you, yeah. know, you, you take it to, to be something you, else. Yes, you take it personal. Yeah. So yes, maybe, but what if it's like a... What you call yeah. it? Like um, a mechanism where you are just like always... Yeah, yeah, yeah on the defensive. On the defensive, yeah. yeah. Yes. Um, uh, I think w what, uh, what, I, what I think uh, with regards to Ndebele people and Shona people and this whole debate, it's like when we were talking to Kao Joshua at the time, mm -hmm. and I was saying even when you go overseas, Ndebele people have Ndebele click, Shona people have a Shona click, and those people don't necessarily get along. And it stems from um, uh, what I call inherited hate. People, there are a lot of ah, people, there are a lot of Ndebele people who grew up and they were told by their parents, Shona people are I'm bad sure people, not. Shona people did this to us, Shona, you understand what I'm saying? And I kind of get it, where it's coming from, do you get it? But I have a problem with people, um, people then treating Shona people as a person, you understand? Oh, okay. A Shona person can do you wrong. But and it doesn't mean Shona, Shona people Shona are bad. People. You understand right. what I'm saying? Mm. The so same way a developed person can do can you do, wrong. Yeah. I can have one developed person who's really fucked up, right? But mm. I, I'm not going to say developed people are fucked up because the one person fucked me over. You understand? Right. So it's the same thing. People inherit hate. People hate people they, they've never been in contact with because those people are from a certain tribe. And I think it's wrong. At some point, it has to be addressed. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Because we grew up in an era where uh, we, we never did anything wrong to each other, maybe because we're from a later period or whatever, yeah. but I'm not going to ignore that there's a history of some sort, which is where all this hate comes from. But I have a problem with people then just uh, assuming that all Shona people are bad people because there was some Shona person who was bad to you. Yeah, I think we just need to get that whole <clears throat> yeah. in and, inherited and, uh, yeah. beef out. Yes, you know, you, you, you know, borrowed emotions. Don't come, ahead, don't come expecting emotions. me to, you know, to do something wrong and then find me doing something wrong when I actually haven't done anything wrong. Are you, okay you know what I mean? So right. No, I'm good. Okay. I'm not just there to get that out of the way because yeah, we did we did uh <laughs> <laughs> uh okay. Yeah. Yeah, the whatever. channel did mention something trying to explain what happened, but mm -hmm. people weren't trying to have it. No, because, they were not you know, yeah. So, you know, so if you if you're that sensitive and uh, this might not be a good place to be because we are so open and, and we try and address everything as it is. No, you know. Yeah. Yeah, and no, but other than that, um, there were just two or three people who really lashed out yeah, about yeah, that yeah. comment. Yeah. But I, I, there I was hope one person now who said, "I hope Danny apologizes to all Ndebele people." I don't like it when people <laughs> when people separate themselves. We're all Zimbabweans, right? When I see Zimbabwean people, I don't see Ndebele, Tongo, whatever. You understand? When you say apologize to Ndebele people, if ever I did anything wrong and I was meant to apologize, I would apologize to Zimbabweans in general, not Ndebele people. Or Tonga people, because wh why are we everybody. segmenting? Our, you know, we are just one people. That's that's how I see it. So I get offended when somebody calls me a tribalist. You know, because there's no ounce of tribalism in my blood. Yeah, definitely, hundred <coughs> percent. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. So you're okay now, and yeah, no, I'm good. All right. I'm good.
Akula manch. Akula. Akula. Sisi meanga iri ya ita. Yes, this is ya ita. Okay, so there's there, we have someone in studio um, with us. Yeah. Very interesting somebody. Um, I just our very first guest. Our very. If, if you, I think people have to, because we're not going to go through all the stuff because yeah. he's been on the show. He's been he's, on the he's show. He's episode before. number one on the show. It's a very nice show. People must yeah. go but and watch I, it. I must just say this is my first encounter with yeah. him. Although there's yeah. a background story that I did something. Mm. <laughs> you, ee, Shit. Ee. Now that you've brought it up. Ee. Now that you've brought it up. I don't remember. Now that, that day. you've brought I it don't. up. You know, Becky guy. <laughs> I don't know. What did you do? I don't know. What didn't you do? Do I look like Nanovaira? 100%. Who said mm. Clearly. Yeah. After. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah um, look Actually, like. Chavi, get off the mic. You there was a nice like. voice on the last episode. Yeah. People want that voice. <laughs> they, want the la- <laughs> they want the nice voice. They want Nash's assistant. <laughs> they want Nash's assistant. <laughs> Nash, I don't remember that incident. I don't remember that day in do question. You know what? Let me tell you this. Right, the guest you're about to have is a superstar, right? Right, a proper superstar, mm-hmm. proper like. Pr- and I, I tell him over and over that this country is too small for him. Right. Right. But for him to remember such an incident, uh, what if you right. made it up? Um, what if this you guy, made it up? this guy has been all over the world. What if right. you made but it up? But for him to remember such, tell me some incident, of the countries he's been to, bro. Europe, he's been to London, right? Poland, right? Ireland, right? Switzerland, right? Belgium, wow. He's got. Uh, he might be going to, I think, Ukraine. And that's right, a might. Right. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, might to, to go to, to go Ukra- and motivate the yeah, soldiers he, to Ukraine soon. Oh, right, soon fire. Right, this is soon. Fire. Right, this is this is the person we're dealing with here. Right, Uk- I don't know Ukraine. Imagine, <laughs> hey, to go and 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 motivate the soldiers. Yeah, or right. he's gonna wow. do a set for them there. That's, that's, right? that's dope. Well, what will he be playing though? I'm a piano. Yeah, I mean, this the is Ukra- the Ukrainians know I'm a piano. I'm sure if it's just a beat, they'll just move. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah. so this is the sort of guy we're dealing with. I mean, mm-hmm. so for him to remember such an incident, it, it, it really messed up his self esteem, his ego, right? Because he's not used to that, he's what used happened? to people Yay! running to him. What happened? But, what? Yeah. <laughs> what so, so the, the guest uh, approached uh, Sis Becky. Mm-hmm. Sissy Big was sitting with, I, I don't know, I think with some of her friends. Oh. Mm-hmm. And you know when you greet people and then they... Who's that? Oh, yeah. Uh, Tiripa Show. Uh, yeah. We're we on the show. So... I, I think maybe put it on silent also because... Oh, so vibrates. the guest went to oh, greet oh, Sissy Big. Let me... Jesse, can I finish my story? Yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. go. Ignore me. Uh. I, I'm not here, bro. Um, so the guest went to greet Sis Big. Sis Big was sitting with her friends, and Sis Big he gave him, you know, that hand, that like, you know, when you're trying to, you know, that little hand to just, could you can greet my finger uh, type thing. Mm. That's what she did to the guest. Ooh. The, the guest called me and said, "This is not okay." He was traumatized. He was traumatized because it's the first time in his entire life this has ever happened to him. Mm. People ran to him, but this lady. So Biggie made history. Yeah, she gave him a finger. And you can greet the finger. Huh. Talk to the head. I didn't know you were uh, I didn't know you were like I that. I will take the fist Yo. bump, but do I look like no, someone no. who would do that? Uri <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> no, but no, honestly. Mm-hmm. Does that sound like Becky? Uh-oh. It kind of does. I think, I, think, I think Becky's husband would like love that, right? Yeah. People come and approach you and try and no, say No, but hi. I've never and done anything like, because yeah. of my husband. Let's just get that clear. Okay. I've never done anything because of my husband. He's mm. he, he is not my moral compass. Right, right. right. Ni, like my own moral compass, my own mode of operation. Mm. And I'll do it because Becky wants to do it. I won't do it because Becky oh, yeah. doesn't want to do it. But but Becky, just for the record, just show us how you greeted him again on the camera. Like how was it? I don't remember that incident. I mean how I mean how do you greet people you don't want to greet? How do you how do you do that? Hey, I mean, I, how do you greet people you don't want to greet? I would never extend my hand. Okay, so you're okay, but you're not forced. I would never extend my hand if I don't want to greet you. All right, so like, she, she, she's uh, hey. pl- pleading not guilty. She's pleading not guilty, but I mean, at least, I mean, the guys here, yeah, we're not going to discuss this. I, th- I, <laughs> I felt, <laughs> I felt <laughs> big. that was wrong. You, you, know, you don't you greet know. our people like that. Mm. But that's uh, just true. That's just true. I mean, you know. Yeah, that's just it's, it's and, and, and he's <laughs> laughing because he knows it's not true. No, no, no. He called me. <laughs> He called me and said, "Ko begi de bugwe begi." I thought begi de. Begi de wa begi. I just said ko begu. 
So I mean, probably this is probably the first uh, um, problem because they were faced in the winter. Because back in the day, gospel guy on the Sunday. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. now we didn't know the gospel people do this too. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I thought it was. I didn't know the yeah the I arrogant like this. Hey Remo. <laughs> oh, f- finally. <laughs> oh. Okay. All right. All right. I'm He's okay. Even the earth shook. <laughs> mm. I'm doing good. How are you? Becky. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Le- ladies and gentlemen, DJ Remo. Yeah, Jen, for uh, Dennis, you gotta have to put some respect on Remo. You gotta have to, you know what I mean? You gotta give him his respect. You just can't say just DJ. Right, right. Let's, let's, let's take it. Le- yeah, let's take it from the top. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. our next guest yeah. is when a superstar. 400 pounds. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a superstar, a DJing legend. Yeah. He's one of the hottest, if not the hottest DJ on the top <laughs> scene. Yeah. He has toured South Africa, Dubai, mm. the States, mm. England. Mm. Everybody know this guy. Yeah. He's one of the hottest guys on Instagram, and a lot of chicks uh, can attest to that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, DJ Remo. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Half man, half amazing. <laughs> half what? <laughs> half man, half amazing. Okay. Okay. What's going on, DJ okay. Remo? What's going on, Danny J? Becky, we yeah. meet again. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> In my territory. Yeah. <laughs> number one bullshit. Nah, number one. Number one. one. <laughs> number one. <laughs> <laughs> but how it's you? okay. How are you? you? Oh, good. Yeah, uh, this is uh, Remo's second episode, right? Yeah. We had to bring him in um, to discuss some stuff that has to do with his industry. Yeah. Uh, more importantly, the um, situation that happened with DJ Maprisa and Kabza. Oh, that was and, it. And, uh, in, in Bulawayo. And I believe um, uh, Remo and his team faced something similar. Not, uh, not so long ago. Uh, yeah, so first off, so we get into the whole DJ Mabori. So we yeah. first find out how Remo is doing. Yeah, let's find out how Remo is doing. Um, and you what's see, I'm happening. even playing nice. I know. I oh, know. you're playing nice. <laughs> no. mm. Okay, not, not like that. Okay, okay. ish. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so what's been happening? DJ Chilling Remo. Danny. Chilling. Yeah. Uh, uh, the streets of Harare. Mm. A lot of things must have happened from episode one. We're now on episode 28 or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a lot of uh, uh, developments. What's been going on on your side? A lot. Where do I start from? Yeah, the beginning. <laughs> Let's do it. The beginning. Mm. Talking about the tours. Or the last country that you were in. Um, yeah. What was happening And And there. then also you posted uh, some, uh, some sexy pic of uh, a chick in the, in, the, <laughs> in the strip club, right? I saw that everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Zim celebs, you saw that, right? Like, Zim wow. celebs. Stripper Bay. Oh, oh Stripper Bay. <laughs> okay. That's her? Is okay. That? Yeah. <laughs> um, the last country was in, um, I toured the US. Right. Yeah, I had a show in Dallas and in New York. All oh, right, right. Yeah. What music were you playing there? Um, I was playing uh, Niger music, uh, Ama Piano, mm-hmm. and a bit of uh, Zimbabwe music. Because um, Why a bit? Why a bit? You must play a lot of Zimbabwe. You know, like slowly music. introducing it to people, you know. Yeah. I don't think most people are familiar with like a Zim sound. I thought everybody. Or are they not? Or, or are they? Well, the Zimbabwean community, yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, the Zimbabwean community. But it was mainly South Africans, Malawian, and uh, Zambian community. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they loved? They loved it. Nice. But in Dallas, I did mm. play a lot of Zimbabwean music. Dallas, because oh, yeah, Dallas is like Harare. Yeah, yeah. But yes. also, guys, you should remember that the the quality of music we're producing here is crap. Is trash. But but I what mean, about what about Nyasha no, David? No, 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 I mean, we we have I mean, three we, 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 we have three have. artists or three or five artists. Nyasha right? David, that, that's one. Takuda? Two, give me five. Uh, Ja, maybe we're gonna put him there, yeah, even right. though he's now diluted. Oh, but we do, we do have good music. Hmm? Why yeah. are you mentioning on, on only men? Okay, who's there? Oh, okay. Oh, Sandra, Sandra Debele, Sisi Kiki. I mean. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Tammy Moyo, Amara Brown, yeah, we've, we've Anita of, Jackson. We've got a lot of. Um, yeah, but then, you know. But then. A lot of artists. We're talking about jams that in a club. Music. Mm-hmm. Are you saying you can't play their jams? Okay, let me just leave this one. I, I, I beg to differ with Nash, though. I, I think there are quite a number of um, talented Zimbabwean artists that I actually play, to be honest. 
See, we were to be politically correct. Yeah. But this is not that type of show. This is not that type of show. This is not that type of show. Just trying to balance it out. Did, did you agree, Danny? I'm just um, saying. No. No, they, we have a few. We, a few. We, we, we have a few. We have a few playable yeah. people. I said five. Give me five. We are still on three. Saga, I already. Tell, tell me more you can be put in there. Who's on your playlist? Like when you yeah, then go, mix go in. Yeah, you see, okay. I mean, you see, you're trying to be politically go, correct. Go easy, bitch. Nati Oro. Nati Oro. Nati Oro. Give us names, Remo. Uh, Toki Vibes. Okay, mm-hmm. two. Um, Jabrazer. He's got a few bangers. Winky D, of course. Four. Uh, Holy Ten. Five. Uh, Kiki Badass. Six. Um, who else? Takura. Takura. Seven. On your playlist, like the other yeah, day, like you've mixed on, their music. On, on my playlist. Stana. Stana? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> seven. Oh, it's eight now. Eight, yeah. eight. Okay. <laughs> I do play Stana. Oh, which song? <laughs> uh, right, so, uh, so yeah. after which Dallas, one? <laughs> <laughs> which one? Do you want me to sing it? I thought he was going to get stuck. Kanaune Godo Godo Zanai Shanje. That's that's from 1985. Right, right, right. Shout okay. out to you, Stana. All right, okay, yeah, okay. Wait, so, so were we you just doing that to rub Danny? Oh, okay. Mm. Nah, we're good with Stunner, right? No, no we're good. No, 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 no we're definitely good with Stunner. We're yeah. good with Stunner. Mm. All right, so from Dallas, then what, you came back here or... You yeah, I came back here. I um, had a show in South Africa. Uh, That's where Stripper Bay is? No, Stripper Bay is in America. Oh, Stripper Bay is in America? Yeah. Oh, okay. We saw... You didn't see the picture, Becky? Hey, I don't look at things like that. Baku, I, I want I the see. picture. Go you see, I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> Go I've just said it, right? So you're gonna see. It's not gonna be on the episode. It's Bako. going to be there. He's Bako. going to put it. He's, I know, Bako. <laughs> just remind him. All right, okay. I'm reminding him on <laughs> during the show. It's you one understand? of those. I'll be just, like, you saw. Just call the number on the screen. And on then 26 no minutes and 33 seconds, I say put the picture. And then there's no picture. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know. Mm. Okay, so Stripper Bay, you and Stripper Bay just friends or Janga Shushun Jabas? What's up, what's up? Or oh, you're hot and I'm out. <laughs> uh, I think, Becky, firstly, you need to follow the story and then you ask me that. I think on the next episode. I want mm. just go ga 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 ga. Ga 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 ga. Stripper Bay started in 2000 and I can't remember. It's a series. It's a series. Oh, it's a series. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Upcoming reality show. Mm hmm. Oh, okay, now I need to follow them. Yeah, See? upcoming reality okay. show. So All right, so I will follow. what my posts are based on. Okay, so yeah. I'm going to follow, and then the next time you come back, I'm going to ask you, so... <laughs> How far? How far? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it, then uh, business-wise, music? Good. Good. Just just good. Just, just, just good. Um, uh, what, would you, what would you like to know, Becky? Since we're on that What, what about... Tell us about dreams. Dreams nightclub is it still yeah. there? What's uh, happening? Do business. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening with Dreams? Uh, currently, it's closed, yeah, right? it's closed. Currently, we're closed for renovations. Okay. Yeah, we're closed for reno- renovations. Renovations yeah. for real? For real? For real? What we've are you renovating? Running, we've been running the business for four years. Oh, same without concept, same oh, okay. everything. So we're trying to change it up a little. So bit. when you reopen, like what new lights and stuff, flooring. <laughs> 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 Becky, have you ever been in the club? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, everything. Uh, well, not necessarily the lights, but just the whole setup of the club. Mm-hmm. Maybe a few more lights. You see, I, I know what yeah, I'm talking no, you about. You know what you're talking it's about. about yes. It's always about lights. It's always about lights. You know, rearrange mm-hmm. the setup and everything. Do we believe him, Nash? I mean, I'm looking like directly at him. He, number you one sound- bullshit guy. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> I couldn't have said it better. Sure. Okay. All right. Okay. So we'll just take his word. We'll take his word for now, right? Now mm. that we got that out of the way, mm. um, he, he, he couldn't wait to just like okay, and then we're doing this, and then yeah, yeah, mm. yeah you know, just lights and you know, yeah, 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 yeah. Hello. Yeah, yeah. You might not be uh, telling us everything, but time will tell. Because if you renovate, at some point you're going to reopen. Yes, you're going to have to reopen at some point. For sure, for sure. So we're waiting. Waiting on that day. Okay, so while you're waiting for the club to renovate, Mm -hmm. what what else has been happening? Uh, Mm Business-wise. Well, as you know, I'm into retail. So that's what I've been pretty much uh, been focusing on. And uh, DJing. 
outside the country. Okay, well, back to the club renovating. Was it a unanimous decision? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, she's trying to understand. To, no, like yeah. to like. Cl- Okay, let me tell you what happens uh, Thank you. in the entertainment industry. Yes, please. I'll give an example. Um, we've got a new clubs, uh, a lot of new clubs that have opened. There's Karma, uh, Pablo's is back. Pablo's was closed for renovations, and mind you. And evidently so. Yes. We saw them remove the roof and <laughs> do stuff. Yes. Right. Yeah. We could actually see. We can pass yeah. by dreams right now. Yeah. No, you can. Feel free. I'll take you there personally. And there's renovations happening. No, obviously we haven't started. It's only been two weeks. We closed two weeks ago, so we haven't started yet. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're going to plan on my renovations, yeah. actually. <laughs> okay, so what happens so, in the entertainment industry? So I was saying, um, in the entertainment industry, um, especially when new clubs open, um, look, we've been operating for the past four years, mm-hmm. if not five. So obviously there's this whole buzz about Kama, Hash, Pablo's reopening. Right. So, I mean, as a client, would you come to Dreams oh, knowing okay. that There's we're giving you the same shit over and over, over, and over again? Shit, you said. For the, no, I mean, look, stuff. Like, as in stuff. stuff. Yes. Okay. Stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Look excuse, at you trying to go uh, right. excuse, <laughs> my, excuse my language. Yeah. So, I mean, people love different things. That's true. You understand? Yeah, so, we like new things. So, what, as a business person, what am I providing or giving to you, That's for you to come yeah. support me, uh, that come is not uh, providing for you. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. It's, it's, that's how it, that's how it goes. So there's Kama, Hash, Pablo's. There's another club that's open. I mean, we're not there to advertise people's clubs. But yeah, it's, just okay. Say, yeah. it's okay. Yeah. 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 It's okay. Yeah. 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 I want to emphasize my point. Just like, trying to emphasize yeah. why. So there, there's no problems. There dreams. <laughs> there's no <laughs> problems. There's obviously, dreams. Obviously, there are problems, but they're internal problems. Okay, because yeah. uh, I might have heard, you yeah. know, some. <laughs> what did you hear? What did you hear? No, 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 no. Yeah, I mean, every, every, every business yeah. has problems. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. We even have our problems in here. Exactly, but yeah. that's not yeah. the topic at hand. All right, all right. <laughs> I'm right. just saying. <laughs> okay. Episode um, thirty-two, maybe I'll be back. <laughs> yeah. Um, and and ever since, um, let's talk a bit about G. Uh, DJ Towers came out the other time and said something about G and. Mm-hmm. Um, who, who responded to that? Um, what's her name? Shali? Shali, yeah. Yeah, she responded. Uh, what's your take on that whole situation? What happened with uh, DJ Towers? And you can also uh, check out DJ Towers uh, on the channel. Episode 3, I think. Yeah, DJ Towers. Be specific. Then. That's, for the, you, that's for the views. <laughs> that's for the views. DJ Towers came out and, right. and, 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 and said some, mm-hmm. um, yeah, and attacked G right. and, um, and accused him of all sorts of stuff. Okay. And if I remember correctly, for us to get DJ Towers, mm-hmm. it was you organized for him to come to the show. That's I think. right. So, so yeah, like the same. I think you are, you guys have uh, had or have a relationship of some sort. Tell us what you think about that post because that post was everywhere. We saw that post. driving. You cannot drive my car. cocaine. Okay, Actually, a rant. Yeah, it was. It was a rant. I, I, saw, I saw the video. I saw the video. Um, was he serious? Nemas Ziran with DJ Towers, or was he just being DJ? Are, are Towers? you? I don't think. Bako, he... Bako, do you think you might be able to give us the rant as well on on the episode? Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that perspective the picture is good. you will get huh? but the, this the, the is rant not... we'll try our best okay yes. right. Becky, you <laughs> asked you, Becky. Becky you asked me a very interesting question and I think you answered your own question mm. when you said were you guys not close were you not tight yeah um, I want to ask you this did you, did you follow G at any point in your life once in a while. Once in a while. Like if I'll see a post, I'll just okay. follow through to see what was happening. Have you seen? Have you ever seen me out with G traveling, partying, or whatever? No, except for like posts. Yeah, posts. Not, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, you've yes, seen that, right? Yes, yes. Have you seen towers in any of those posts? So, um, the guy's not qualified to say. No, not qualified. Stuff? I mean, look, he had a relationship with G, but it was based mainly on business. That's it. Not, we were close. Oh, DJ Towers, where you at? Let's roll. None of that. He would come to the house, sell us what he wants to sell, and then he goes. What, what, what would he sell? 
uh, PVO um, merchandise. Uh, can we just give perspective to those who don't know what Tawa said? Uh, do you guys remember what he said? Um, he said something like... He was um, very angry, that's all I remember. Yeah, he said, G- how, do you, how do you drive oh, under uh, the, Yes, under the influence, under the influence and then of, drugs. Drugs. of drugs. So yes. here's my yes, response yes, yes, to yes, that. Yes. Were you ever and expect there? expect not to be in an accident Were you ever or something there like that? When G was taking drugs? Or have we ever, ever entertained you for more than an hour? Right. That's all I'm saying. Look, Towers, I, I, was, I, was, I was shocked. I'm not going to lie. In fact, shocked is an understatement. I was pissed. Mm-hmm. You understand? So, a lot of cats in Narari, they use other people for clout. Right. You understand what I'm saying? <clears throat> they use other people for clouts, and Towers is one of them. Right. Right. I'll give you an example. Um, I, was, I, was, I was close with G. G was my best friend. One of my best friends. Um, I stayed with the guy for three years. But Danny J, Becky, did you at any point, at any point see me post, oh, I'm by G's grave, I'm here to put flowers, ETC. Did you, at any point did you see me post that? No, but I'm sure you did go. Just because mm-hmm. I didn't post it doesn't mean I wasn't there. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. That, that was one of the most um, difficult times in my life. Yeah. And it's not necessary for the world to see or I feel I have to explain to the world, no, this was my best friend. Let me go drop her flowers every second. I'm not looking for clout. I had a genuine relationship with G, like a genuine friendship with, with G, you understand? Yeah. So look, at the end of the day, Towers is shooting himself in the foot. That's all I can say. Because he, he clearly got help from mm. G, right? He did. Uh, G would support no, he, he, whatever he did. He, business. He put him out there. He put him out there. Yeah, he put him right. out there. Yeah. So for him to then just get his phone and be like... You, you understand what I'm saying? Ranting. Yeah, and it's, it's, look, uh, things happen in life, you understand. Um, an accident is something that you can't avoid. If it's your time, it's your time. You get what I'm saying? So whether it was negligence, driving... G wasn't drunk that day. I specified on the last episode he wasn't drunk. He was his, his normal self. He was just high on energy. He wasn't drunk when he had the accident. But G's weakness was he loved speed. That was that that, that was that's what, that was his weakness. Yeah. He loved speed because he had fast cars. So for for towers to rant like that, what do you think was behind him just getting his phone? That's why I asked, was he serious or was he just being towers? You know, towers would sometimes. I, I think he wanted to trend. Post I think, like yeah, jokes I th- I think so and stuff. I'm, I I even called Danny over that issue. Like I, I need to look for this boy. And he's the one who told me, would you not, it's not worth it, just, you know. Oh, so you, you, you didn't look for him? No, I left it like that. I'd, look, it's, it's just like if I'm close with Nash, right? Nash, imagine Nash just starts ranting about someone, you know? It's, it's something that shocks you. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It, it, it will shock you. Hey, has anybody spoken to, ta- to, um, um, to DJ Towers to hear what that whole thing was about? Who? Apparently, he apologized the following day, saying that I was, I was. Was he high on something or what? He doesn't drink. He doesn't. Oh, shit. But shit. Okay. Was he emotional? What happened? Emotional like, about what? Hey, yeah, men are going through a lot of stuff, Shamar. Uh, uh, but, but I read but a legendary. Why, but why, I read a legendary yeah. crane. Yeah. yeah, why would you attack someone that's no longer there? I'm not okay, guys. <laughs> <laughs> legendary Uchema. Yeah, so that was personally, legendary Uchema. Personally, like, look, I wasn't going to come out here and um, seem like I'm attacking towers, but you know, some things, you can't just keep quiet about certain things, Danny. You know what I mean? I mean, G was yeah. my boy, and yeah. towers at the end of the day, Mvana. You understand mm. what I'm saying? He's, he's, he's a young and I'm going to be up, I'm not. I'm not afraid of towers. If he's wrong, he's wrong. Yeah, yeah. I think he knows no, he's wrong. Um, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I, he knows I, I, wrong. I didn't um. understand it. I was like, wasn't this the man who was crying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then the next. I mean, there, there's so like, many occasions that towers had lives, even with uh, G's sister. Oh, G's my best friend. Oh, we did this, we did that. At any point, I never uh, went on my live um, feed to uh, towers. Stop claiming. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So at any point, if, do you know if any of the family members looked for him after that rant he did? Kushamari, what is this? I know Neria was really emotional about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she she was emo- She called me and um, she was asking me what are we gonna do about the situations uh, about the situation. Sorry, 
I told her, what do you want to do? He's just looking for attention. Leave it at that. That's all it is. You don't see anyone responding to, you know, just leave it. That's towers for you. But it, yeah, he did, he did get some attention. I yeah, guess. that's towers for you. I don't oh, know yeah, what he did. You he can't got expect. people talking yeah. and, and all sorts. But then you guys said he apologized the next day. Or something, yeah, because there was such, such a backlash yeah. from people oh, okay. because uh, everybody was upset about it. Like, uh, the guy is dead. Why are we bringing him back to And the, they keep bringing him up, man. Yeah. yeah. Yo, they keep bringing... How, how, how does that make you feel? you just like, geez, I just lost my G and I just want him to rest in peace. But every now and again, you'll find mm. that post, that post, this one saying this, that one saying that. And some mm -hmm. some posts were... were, were, were were even uh, claiming that you like would force yourself mm -hmm. on G as a friend, like G would just be like, <laughs> "This guy is just always around me," <laughs> and all of that. But you know yeah. the relationship you yeah. had with. Uh, how does that then, like? Becky, I just come back to the same point. Um, I don't owe anyone an explanation, and I'm surely not going to explain myself to the whole world. You understand? Yeah. I knew my relationship. The people who were around, the genuine friends that were around, knew mm -hmm. the relationship. That's all that matters. Let's let the guy rest. That's Jeez, all I'm please, saying. Let's, let's let, let the guy, the guy rest every single second. Gee this, gee, gee that. You know, let's let the guy rest. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Sarah, I will also just let the whole GG Towers yeah, yeah, rest and right. also mm. some drug. No, 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 ah, no, 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 no. I think mm. uh, at that uh, time and moment, I was in my emotions, so. That's why we've got Danny J. <laughs> but if you had yeah. found him, shit, Nash. <laughs> if, if if we had found Towers, you you were gonna have a round table with you, him. Yeah, I mean, of course, we're gonna speak to him nicely. Like a Jada, uh, yeah. like a Jada Pinkett round table. Mm. Or yeah, yeah, no, yeah, round yeah. table. No, we all a, all a square one. Yeah, we no, would have, no, would have. No, okay. I'll no, we we cool with him. We, 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 we cool with him. Cool with towers. Towers. But in the no. past, though, yeah, mm. when we must started going to the gym. <laughs> it would a whole different story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because he wasn't in the picture. Yet, yeah, Charles was in the picture. Yet, yeah. No, I would have, I would have told him as, uh, as a young brother, to the route that you, uh, that you took. Nah, we mm -hmm. don't do that. You know, I would personally ask him what we think. Oh, what's going on with you? Tell me. This guy, number one bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't gonna do that. <laughs> I wasn't gonna do that. Um, <laughs> and then. Uh, is there anything else we need uh, to ask Rima about catching up uh, before we uh, we get into that story with the DJs? Mm. Mm. He's pretty no. much, yeah, he's pretty much. Um, everything else you want to know about DJ Remo, episode one uh, on the Danny J Show. You can go watch that. Um, yeah, and let's see if he wants to tell us something. Is there I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. good. Are you sure? I'm sure. Okay. So, Except the talk to your hand thing. Yeah. This, wow. This, this this is how she greeted me. Mm. Yeah. At least she did. I mean, at least she did, Becky. I mean, you know, imagine not being greeted at all. You, yeah. you reached out a, a pinky finger. Ten foot. Mm. Like, Im imagine a table surrounded with women, mm -hmm. you know, acting all cool and shit. Yeah. Mm. yeah. <laughs> Everyone showing you love, except Becky. Hmm. Becky gave you the finger. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to the hand. <laughs> that's, G, that's G shit there, Becky. <laughs> that's that Christian stuff right yeah. there. Yeah, uh, no. Uh, that's fire. That's dope. No. No, um, no, but I understand why <laughs> she couldn't be there. Okay, why? Why yeah, was it? I understand why. Okay, anyway, she was my ex was there the and she was showing loyalty to my ex. The DJ man. <laughs> <laughs> That's why she greeted me like that. You know, if we have to put it out there, Becky. <laughs> oh, that was the day. Yeah, the, you're, you're well, now you remember. remember. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. All right. Uh, I vow to <laughs> thee, my God. <laughs> Tell us about uh, the girls. Let's start off with the girls. Which girls? Which girls? TXC. All oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, my bad. Right, right, right. Cool. right, right. Hey, this is Remo. Oh, <laughs> 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 oh, so this is okay, Remo. You okay, never right. know. Uh, so you were instrumental in bringing in uh, TXC. I, I, I did not know these DJ girls uh, before then. Right. So I the, uh, Yeah, I've never heard their music, but apparently they're popular. Yeah. They're DJs. Yeah, the the TXC, the, yeah, the, the DJs, the two are they twins? No, oh, they're just friends. Okay, yeah, two the two colored oh, girls. Oh, and they did. Oh, the color and they DJ together. Yeah, and those they girls. like swap and what 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 what. One is a they? dancer. Yes. And one, oh, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Okay. So so they came. Yeah, uh, but they didn't perform. They didn't perform. Yeah. So, so tell us that story. What, what happened? Where with, were they uh, meant to perform? In Kariba, uh, for a private boat party. Did the boat party continue though? No, it couldn't. They were the glue. 
the glue. Yeah, All right, sure. so what happened? What happened with TXC? Okay, so basically, um, TXC landed on a Friday, Friday afternoon. Uh, we went to pick them up at the airport, uh, security team, media, everything. So, I mean, just from the get-go, though, just, hey, <laughs> I never the lost for words. Divas. Yeah. Divas. But don't you ever act like that, Rima? Never. I'm one humble guy. <laughs> Becky, I greeted you. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh. You did that for you. <laughs> you you did, did that for you. I did that for you. I humbled myself. I humbled myself to come okay. greet you. It's okay. Yeah. All right. So right. you've you've never had like your diva moments. No, no, as no, no, no. Jackson. It's it's bad for business. I'll be honest with you. It's bad. You just have to be humble all the time. Is okay. Yeah, let me watch my words. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you just have to be humble. I mean, it's yeah. part of it's part of the thing. But uh, but but sometimes uh, uh, cats stretch you, right? Somebody yeah. will come. Somebody will come yeah. to the, this. Hey, oh, you haven't played. You haven't played this song. <laughs> yeah. 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 After a while, we come back. Yo, the, the song. <laughs> <laughs> Do you stay cool? <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Mm. I try my best. Uh huh. Like the incident last week. My goodness. <laughs> Oh, there's one fresh. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Imagine so, you're DJ, uh -huh. and someone just comes and smacks you at the back of your head for 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 <laughs> for you to get his attention. He smacks you, and you're ready to no like, uh, selfie. <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> um, um. Okay. Shit. Wow. You understand? He did wow. that three times. And you still kept your cool. I had to. The guy was high, so I had to play. Oh, yeah, because you have to deal with high people differently. Yeah, yeah. And it was crazy, but he kept on. He kept on. Worse off when I stopped. When I finished uh, DJing. Oh my goodness. He was. He was, was on me. <laughs> have you ever had a situation? <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah. before <laughs> you talk about the guys, <laughs> do guys do this, that to mm -hmm. other guys? Do what? Like be on all up and the post selfie. No, no, it's it's oh, yeah, look. Yeah, yeah. There's there's some guys that uh, actually motivate. You understand? And there are a lot of guys yeah. that send me DMs that I give a lot of uh, motivational. Oh, uh, don't you get, don't like you get chicks come up to you? Oh, baby, I it's have okay it. for girls. I, I, to I do talk that. to a lot of guys uh, okay. that uh, seek for advice on you know how to just survive. Mm -hmm. okay. You know, a lot of um, you know those are okay. I get a lot of DMs. So I specifically open those uh, DMs, you know, just, you know. You'll be like, oh man, thanks so much for what, what, what. A lot of people okay. appreciate um, what I put uh, to the table. A lot of people appreciate the music that I play. So, you know, it's just right to respond to a couple of DMs. All right. So now back to these DJ mm -hmm. girls. Right. They come, they land, and it's attitude up to here. Yeah. So I asked the road manager at the time, is everything okay? Why are they giving us attitude? They didn't even greet anyone. Right. When this is at the airport. At the airport. Right. And she was like, No, they had a show last night, so they're tired. Okay, fine. It's cool. So what's the plan? What's the game plan? Like uh, from now, I mean you're saying they're tired, so we might as well um take them to the hotel, they rest, and then mm -hmm. we catch up later on. So the plan that specific day was um we picked them up, um we organized a private uh, a private party for them. Where like a meet and greet, okay. Uh, so to say, uh, at Pablo's. So you remember mm -hmm. at the time, uh, curfew was uh, 10 p.m. Okay. Right. So um, we called the owner of Pablo's uh, to help uh, provide a venue for the girls, and you know she she she's a big fan of the girls actually. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the directors. She's a big fan. She was all for it. She's like, no, I can do it. Um, what do you guys need? She's like, oh, are you are you trying to sponsor? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'll sponsor the guests. Alcohol's on me. Um, so curfew was ten o'clock. So she specified that Remo, please, can you make sure you and the girls are here by eight o'clock? Mm. We cannot exceed ten p.m. Like, yeah, no, it's cool. I got it. So we dropped the girls off. They slept. Um, I got there, I think, at 7.45. The girls were up. The, I saw them uh, smoking shisha. They weren't dressed. So I speak to the road manager, like, Ko Alpha. She's like, Alpha with what? Like, didn't your manager tell you that uh, we've got a private function for you guys tonight? Had you told the manager that this is what... The man, I, I, I deal directly with the manager. Okay. So remember, when artists come, they come with the road manager. So they're supposed to have 
um, their schedule, what they're supposed to do, or whatever, right? right? right, right. Which the manager was communicating with. With the okay. Yeah. So, what are you talking about? What function? Look, okay. Give me a moment. I'll give. You, I'll, I'll. I'll get back to you. <clears throat> I called the manager and I say, and I'm like, Sue, what's what's going on? She's like, uh, well, are, are the girls not ready or what? Like, they 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 know nothing of the event. Like, give me a second, Remo. I'll call you. Eight o'clock. I go back. Um, did you speak to your manager himself? Like, yeah, we spoke to her. Sorry, the girls are getting ready. No, she hadn't told us. You know, it happens. It's cool. But please, can you guys? Uh, like make it quick please because remember uh, curfew is 10pm we cannot exceed 10pm right All right, cool those girls got ready at 9.50 10 minutes before <laughs> curfew so obviously uh, uh, Pablo's is uh, Ruby um, is someone that we do business with you know you're not trying to disappoint so I had to show face and show her that this was legitimate. Remember, she was giving people free alcohol at her personal cost, personal expense, right? So we get there. She jumped on me, like, Remo, how can you do this to me? I opened up the club specifically for you. Uh, the girls are not even here. You're right, here, but it's so, like, no, yeah. the girls are here, but what are we going to do? It's almost 10 p.m. But anyway, I've also got private guests. You know, I've got sponsors in there as well. So can the girls come up? They just say their high highs. Then they can go. I went to speak to the manager. So the manager, the whole time she was outside smoking, looking at the venue. I'm like, can we go in? She's like, mm, no. Like, why? Like, I have to go inside. You know, it's protocol. I have to go upstairs and see whether it's safe for the girls, whether there are not a lot of people, ETC. Like, there are not more than 30 people in the club. But anyway, fine. Let's go. Can we? We only have 10 minutes. Let's go and see the venue. <clears throat> went upstairs, went around. Becky, I think there were 20 people in the club. It was strictly by invite. We were not charging. It was strictly by invite. We go downstairs. Uh, they had a moment with the girls, and she came back. I'm sorry. We can't, we can't go upstairs. So the uh, Ruby was next to me. She's like, sorry, what? <laughs> like, no, we can't go upstairs. Why can't you go upstairs? There are too many people in the club. Like, 20. <laughs> like, Excuse me? There are too many people in the club. I'm like, wow. Okay. Um, so what are we going to do? I took this matter really lightly. So they exchanged words with Ruby, like, you guys, you can't do that. At the end of the day, you guys are international artists. The people that came out specifically for you is just a meet and greet. Fine, I understand you don't do that. What's the way forward? And then they quoted me, like, for events like this, we usually charge 150,000 rands. Like, whoa, <laughs> this was not part of the budget. Ruby, please forgive me. I'll be back tomorrow and I'll make it up to you. Like, no, Remo, you can't do this to me. I've given people free alcohol and people are actually thinking this is, you know, fraud. You guys invited us here, but the girls are not even here. Are they even in the country? We explained that to the manager. Like, now at the end of the day, it's business. This is how we do our business. So they they didn't go up? They didn't go up. So at the time, at the time, I then phoned um, the person responsible for bringing the girls and explained to them that they need an additional fee for them to make an appearance. They're like, it's fine. How much do they want? I'll pay them. Right? Yeah. We went and offered the girls that um, uh, the sponsor is willing to pay that. Can we go up? Please. Time is not on our side. Everywhere has to be shut down by 10 p.m. They refused. Like, no, we want to go home now. Money on the table. Like, money, money on is the table. there. Just yeah. go in, please. Ma- yeah. Divas. No, sorry. We can't. Like, whoa. So now I was caught in between. Like, the artists that I have to take care of. And then there's your friendship with... Uh, with the Ruby. relationship with Pablo's. So you can only imagine. So I begged and begged, Ruby, please forgive me. I will see you tomorrow. I promise we will make it up to you. So I had to do... Um, I know, I know. <coughs> Got in the car. Uh, the girls, they didn't even say a word. Mm-hmm. Nothing. Uh, the manager was in the front. The girls at the back. Uh, I dropped them off. So I obviously had to be like, you know, I have to be, you know, this, these are people I'm taking care of. You can't trigger them or press the wrong button. Yeah, just keep it So cool. I explained to the manager, to look, the decisions, uh, the decision that you guys made, at the end of the day, it's merely business. I understand where you're coming from and look, no hard feelings. Let's just focus on what you girls 
came to do. Came to do. Mm-hmm. I'll come Let's go to Kariba. Yeah, I'll come pick your girls up at six o'clock in the morning. We're uh, chartering a plane at seven o'clock, and we cannot be late because this plane has to be in Zambia. Like, okay, cool. Drop them off. Bye bye. Mind you, these girls, they didn't say a word to me. I was just talking to the manager. They did not say a word to me. Um, one girl was outside the parking lot, noticed that TXC was in the car. She came and asked for a selfie. They rolled up the window. Right. They rolled up the window. Right. Like, so, you know, I had to, like, no, now is not the time. The girls are tired, you know. Cool. Saturday morning, I get to where they were staying, Highland's house. The chartered plane is ready. It's ready. So I get, I got there at uh, 5.45, and I just parked in the... I didn't want to be late. <clears throat> 6.30. 7 o'clock. Nobody. 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 So I'm like, no. <laughs> no, this is not making sense. I'm trying to call them. They're not picking up. I go to the reception, and I asked um, one of the receptionists, um, can you please go knock on the girl's door? We have to go. We are late. Like, uh, the girls left at 2 o'clock in the morning. Yo. I was like, what? Yeah, they left at 2 o'clock in the morning. You dropped them off at around uh, 10, 30, 2 o'clock, they were out. Like when you say 2 o'clock, they were out. They went for a walk. <laughs> I, was, I was confused. <laughs> Where did they go with two? Have they, have they gone to the gym? Like, no. They literally checked out. I then found the manager in South Africa. I'm like, Sue, what the hell is going on? She's like, Remo, what did you do to the girls? The girls are back in South Africa. I'm like, okay, Sue. Wait, 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 wait. She waited for you to call her. Imagine. Mm. Imagine. Yeah. Imagine. That's gangster. Like, they, 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 they're working like gangsters, right? Like, yeah, they don't you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm like, wait, Sue, you knew about it. Like, hey, what did you do to the girls? Hey, the girls are upset with me. ETC. Like, okay, Sue, please tell me that you're joking. <laughs> like, I'm confused. I'm like, it's, it's 7.30 now. We can still make, the plane is still waiting for us. Where are the girls? They're in South Africa. What do you mean they're in South Africa? I don't know. They're upset with me, Remo. <sighs> Let me find out what happened. But what, like, and as I told you, is exactly how I put it down for her. Events, ETC, this is what we did. Pick them up, drop them off. We didn't even hang out with them. Like, the person that brought them to Zim didn't, didn't even, even see them. See them. <laughs> he didn't even see them. <laughs> I'll tell you something. I'll tell you something. At the airport, uh, one, of, uh, one of his partners was there because mm-hmm. he was helping out uh, with the cars. One of his partners was there. He tried to help uh, the, one of the girls uh, with the suitcase. Like, no, don't touch my suitcase. He's like, Remo, <laughs> you're on your own. I'm out. Mentality is, is like fucked up, right? Like, yeah. Like, okay. So, Sue, what are we going to do? We paid you guys in full. I think that was our biggest mistake. We paid these guys in full before they perform. Yeah, but you're trying to show... You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 So, basically, she's like, ah, I'll have to get back to you and let you know. What what do you mean? Get back to me. um, Okay, yeah. I want my money. In, 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 In the meantime... Please, can you send the money? Like, I can't do that right now. Like, why can't you do that right now? I mean, they didn't perform. They're not here. Yeah, so can you send us back our money? Like, I'll get back to you. She responded to me after two weeks. Remo, this was the reason the girls left the country, A, B, C, D. And at the time, before they came to Zimbabwe for the second time, it was an issue of security and sound checking. Apparently, we weren't organized when it came to sound check. The girls didn't do sound check, so that was reason enough for them to leave. Here's my question: If it was a sound check issue, how do we do sound check when the venue is 400 odd kilometers, 400? Um, how far is uh, Kariba? 300 something kilometers away. Yeah. Yeah, but this is the reason tra- why we we're leaving. Plane yes. for you, so that we can go. This is the reason we're leaving at seven o'clock. So you've got the whole day to do sound check, and the event starts at eight o'clock. Mm. Hey, security! Hey, we don't feel safe. The guy hired three boats. One boat was specifically for them. This boat has got eight bedrooms, and it will cater for the four of them. Eight bedrooms. What security? They had their own private security. Okay. I'm clearly doing the wrong job. I need to be that famous. Yeah. 
like to be catered to like that and then still complain. But Rimo, um, mm. I'll be honest with you, no one was in those girls. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll be honest Nash with you. Nash is like the only <laughs> thing that will scare a woman away. Um, can I, Nash, no, it's a, it's a very so good question. You, no, it's a very good question. I'll tell you why. Nash, um, look, if that was the case, these girls are from South Africa. Why not reach out to the promoter and say, hey, promoter, I don't feel safe. A, B, C, D did this to me. I don't feel safe, number one. Okay, fine. Maybe not, do, maybe do do be fine. If it was me, why not go to the embassy? The or South the African police. Or, or the just police. report oh. a case. Yeah, why not go to the South African embassy? Like, hey, we don't feel safe in Zimbabwe. We want to go. But they, <laughs> they did everything by themselves. Okay. Yeah. And then, um, and then, uh, so that's them. They escaped. You even tried to sue them in South Africa, did you? Yes, I did. Uh, okay, were well, they refusing to pay back the money? Yeah. So, right. They were refusing <laughs> to pay back the money, and they specified we're not sending anything back. I asked her why, and I even sent uh, um, screenshots of uh, certain um, clause in the, in the in contract, the contract yeah. saying if you don't perform or, you know, you're supposed mm-hmm. to return. At the time, you know, the money that uh, we wanted was the principal for the performance. Yeah. They didn't want to pay that. Forget the expenses. Forget Just the pri- give us our mm. performance money. Yeah, forget the private jet. Forget uh, the, um, the boats. Just what we gave you. Just what we gave you. So he just wanted his principal money back. The fact that they refused, that's what got him agitated. Like, right. Yeah. And then so you tried... Um, you tried to mm. pursue it in uh, South Africa, but <laughs> are they gangster? <laughs> mm. It was a no show. They were like, "Hey, I mean, go for it. <laughs> if you want to sue us, you can yeah. go. Ahead. Go, go oh, for it. Like, like that. Go for mm. it. You know, I mean, our lawyers tried to engage them. Like, I know, sorry. So basically, uh, the manager, uh, the manager's response to the lawyers, like, no, the girls are not around. They're touring A, B, C, D, but don't worry, we'll handle the issue. Etc. Like, oh wow. Okay, mm-hmm. <laughs> so I think uh, uh, a time came where um, I think that's when I started touring. So I had to hold back on the issue and okay. it, yeah. So I had to focus on other things than mm-hmm. uh, that TXE issue. So did you ever like engage them or it's no. it's, it's so, uh, okay, Becky? Uh, let me tell you how bad the situation was. The people I was working with thought that maybe I did something. Oh, I can imagine. Maybe I took money and didn't pay them or we didn't get along. So I keep my chats. You know, I've got records, the contracts, everything I had. So like it wasn't making sense to the sponsor. Could you, no, no, no. It doesn't make sense. How they ca- they can't just leave. Okay, did you give them the full amount? So you say, <laughs> you ask me, did you ever get back the money ETC? They came back to Zimbabwe for another show. They came to perform for another show, which had nothing to do with us. I was supposed to travel to go to Dubai the following day. I had to cancel that flight. <laughs> you were like, right. Mm. No, I'd, if I tell you this, Becky, the guys, they called me, like, Remo, we're going to ask you one more time. Did you do anything with the money? Because we're about to engage the law. So please, if you did anything with the money, save <laughs> us the embarrassment. <laughs> please, save us the embarrassment. Like, dude, mm. I've got the contract with me. All right, if you've got the contract, please come to. Um, they were staying at what's that place called? Um, Quad that place, Quad Diva. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Quad Diva. Oh, um, I don't know, how to, yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah, 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 so like we're going with the law that side. Can you please be present? Um, with the contract, if you've got messages, please just be there. Like, I've got, I've got a flight to catch in the morning, guys. It's 10 o'clock. <laughs> Like, ah, you need to cancel that flight because we need to get down to the bottom of this. Unless you're telling us you were involved. Like, no. So you had to clear your name. I had to clear my name. Yeah. So, after that, I wasn't working with these guys because of that situation. Yeah, I mean. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but, um, but the issue was eventually sorted out? Yeah, it was eventually sorted out. Um, but the girls arrested. No, they weren't arrested. Were they apprehended? <laughs> no, no, no. They weren't arrested. Uh, what happened? Basically, um, I mean, the police... They were, were assisting the they police assisting, in yeah. investigation. Yeah. Okay. So no one was arrested. So we just wanted everything to be done at the police station. So there's no way this guy's kidnapped us, ETC. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? So, I mean, I got there. 
the time that I got there, <laughs> shit, I'd already got now. <laughs> yeah, like the 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 sponsor was was not happy. He was not happy. He just wanted his money back. Yeah. So. And, was just, and he did. He did get it back. Yeah, he got it back. But yes. why do these artists do that? Yeah, Auntie um, Pampanaya DJ Maporisa mm, Mamanje. You know, these South African artists. Uh, I, I think they take us for granted. Uh, and these girls, I, I don't know how you can close people their money, and then come back to the country and think that like nothing uh, happened. Nothing happened. happened. Yeah, I, I, they, 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 I they, get they, that, they were even asked uh, by the guy who was driving them for the specific event that they came from mm. um, that day. That Okay, look, we are, much, we are mutual friends with these guys, so we want to resolve this issue as peaceful as possible. As possible. Mm. Are you guys aware of the money that these guys sent you, or they're just making it up? Her response was, yeah, we are aware of it, but it happened a long time ago. Mm. So it's done? Yeah. Tagal that was a, it happened a long time ago. Her exact words, yeah, but it happened a long time ago. Yeah. I'm just happy that they... they you know, yeah. They, so they now, it's felt. funny. Um, I was trying to... The whole time, for the first time after that incident, mm -hmm. was when the manager got a hold of me. Like, Remo, please, the girls were arrested. Like, no, they were not arrested. Like, oh, really? They were arrested? I'm there. <laughs> yeah. They're not arrested. Look, Sue, I told you about this. The sponsor at the time, I told you, just he just wants wanted the money, back. the money back. I I warned you about this. Like, no, it doesn't it doesn't work that way. ETC, like, oh well, look. No, but how, how how do they think these things? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I I book yeah. you for a job. Mm, you, you, you close you, me. You close me. You go back to your country. You yeah. no show nothing. So they, they actually didn't end up performing, right? They didn't. They didn't, they didn't the, the, the party was they were the glue mm -hmm. for this uh, Caribbean boat party. <laughs> yeah, no, even no, no, even, even the, the next the, time when they, they came. They even the next time when they, they came, perform. they were yeah. the sponsor didn't want. They were inconvenience. The sponsor didn't the want to. police had to like, do their investigation. Yeah, look, you guys, you can perform. I don't have a problem. They just give me my money and you do what you got to do. So, look, I actually don't feel bad uh, talking about this, mm -hmm. but they had the nerve to send me a fake POP. Mm, or to, to say, oh, we've returned your money. We've given you part of your money. Can you let the girls perform? Like, look, I'm not, <laughs> the money does not belong to me. Remember, I was relieved of my duty. I'm, I'm actually uh, <laughs> talking on behalf of you guys. Like, yeah, Remo, at the end of the day, we didn't do the deal with you. We did the deal. Uh, oh, sorry, we didn't do I the deal with um, uh, your sponsor. We did the deal with you. So if you don't settle that situation, hey, you're going to be in trouble. Like, whoa. <laughs> How am I going to be in trouble? <laughs> in that case, I, I think you guys, you need to speak to this guy's lawyer. Because if you're going to be threatening me over the phone, like, no, Remo, we're not threatening you. We just want you to... Help us solve this. Or oh, today you want me to help you solve the situation. Promoters go through the most, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They so do. when it was me, you didn't want to help my situation. And I specified that these guys think that I stole money. Can you please send back the money? And you refuse. Now it's on you. You want me to help you. There's a certain amount of arrogance that uh, these South African acts are displaying. Because if you look at the Mapurisa situation, the Vic Falls Carnival is a big... It's um, a big carnival. It's a big carnival. In, in Zimbabwe, why is it one of the biggest? And then people book you and they pay you in advance. And then you decide at some point, ah, these are just uh, just a Zimbabwean gig. Maybe Did they ever explain Maybe you get another offer somewhere else and then you're like, yeah, it doesn't matter. huh? Did they ever explain why they didn't no. come for the Vic Force carnival? I don't even know. This is the DJ Mapurisa situation. What do you think about that? It's the same sort of situation. The difference is that the Mapurisa one, they returned... The money uh, the for the for yeah. the performance, yeah. but the in, in addition like, to the performance, there's air tickets, there's hotel, there's stuff that is paid in advance yeah. before you make it. So if you if you let people down, you have to be prepared to sort that out as well. Yeah. And and I think that's the situation with these girls. I think it's just arrogance. Yeah, you know, and it's like they, they have the nerve to like post. So the, the yeah 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 and David reposted reposted yeah, yeah. it or something. I can't go think anyway. We said come again. Yeah, was about to say go David David about that. Yeah, David was reposting because what? because because he just heard the one side of the story. He didn't hear yeah from the girls. Yeah, but you know, yeah, yeah, but you know, people believe. Plus, people always believe first. tricky stories. Oh, mm. plus, I think I went to police station. Plus, I think I went to police station. We report and they are right. Yeah. yeah.
Yeah. But that's and a wrong mentality, man. The wrong, wrong, wrong mentality. You know, so so that that I don't I don't I think that you had drama. So Remo, did this um <laughs> did this affect you in any way in terms of like your DMs? Maybe girls thought you were being cruel to other girls. Did it affect the flow? <laughs> <laughs> what flow? Hold up, hold up, what flow? <laughs> flow yet yeah, no. no, because G, Remo's DMs are flowing. Okay. Like they are mm-hmm. f- flowing. They're fluid. <laughs> Very I'll, fluid. I'll, I'll be I'll be honest with you, Nash. Um I was actually surprised. It's 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 uh, that's that's a very good question. I was actually surprised that a lot of people, uh, mainly Zimbabweans and a few South Africans that were involved in that specific event, had my back. No, Remo would never do that. No, Remo's not like that because I think they filed for GBV. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. They filed where here uh, in uh, South Africa. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so like it 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 that's just wasn't making blow. sense. That's yeah. a low blow. Yeah. And apparently, I kidnapped them, and yet I, I got Emo to the, the kidnapper. I got to the party late, but I'm the one who's being thrown under the bus, being the kidnapper. Yeah. Look, I mean, if if something happens in a country and you're not comfortable, you can always go to the police. Yeah, you can always report to the police. You can report to the problem. There's so many people. Even if you're in a hotel, you can just ask the receptionist, please call the police for me. I have True. this problem, whatever. Yeah. But now that happened because these chicks are they come off as being gangsters. Like what the fuck are you gonna do no, to us? We are going like to South Africa, on, you know. You you can't on touch this us. Incident. Mm-hmm. I don't know them personally. Yeah. Right. But w- what they showcased. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You can't you can't touch us or whatever. Yeah. You know. You go to hell if you want to sue us. Go ahead. Go ahead. Because I know you know the legal system can frustrate people. Yeah. No. And, guess, yeah. and guess what? Wait. Guess what? Um, three artists reached out to me during that time that I'm linked to South African artists. Mm-hmm. Right, uh, I'm not gonna mention their names. Um, they're like Remo. There's a situation in Zimbabwe. Please, can you assist? The girls got arrested. Like, which girls? Like TXC. Please, can you help us out? Please, please, please. Like, okay, they're not arrested, and <laughs> I'm in the middle of the situation. And I explained the situation from A to Z. Those specific artists were like. <laughs> Uh, they should have just given you back your money. That's the honest truth. I, we didn't know. No, but w- what is it that we are doing wrong mm. um, in Zimbabwe, mm. like with the pro- with the promoters, where artists always just get away with stuff like that? Yeah. Or like they can be all bougie and diverish. <coughs> we, we, we put we put these guys on a pedestal, yeah, yeah. Yeah. and yeah. then they'll tell you, no, the stage is not right. Oh no, that light is too bright. I can't go on. Or yeah. You know, like we allow them. I think I, I think don't think Zimbabwean artists allow, get the same treatment. He, 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 his, um, I think not all artists are like that. You know, we've got other artists that have been in the game. Remember, these girls are new, right? Mm. For them to <laughs> to treat people the way they they treated us is. <laughs> Do you think they're racist? Maybe it's because they're colored. Is that a thing? <sighs> but I mean, we're all the same race, colored. Mm. All the same people. I mean, I'm yeah. tribal. No, 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 one of them, one of, one of them, one of them, the tribalist. Yeah, yeah, but one, no, Danny. 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 One of them is dating Daliwonga, so racist is out of the. One of them mm. is dating Daliwonga. So we we are we are putting them up there, and this is why they can then just do the shit to us, right? Because we're, I I didn't know the girls, but apparently people know these girls, mm-hmm. and um, and also I think we pay the most. For these artists, because and what they keep coming, what, what they get they paid to perform in South Africa, and what we pay is like, is like worlds apart. Right? We play, we pay so much mm-hmm. for these acts. Um, Mapuri sent them. How much were they paid? How much? How much are these guys paid to to do a, a gig? Do you know how much? How I'm much is sure. they paid? Well, all we know is that they paid eighteen k. So eighteen y- is something U.S. If, bucks. There's something with eighteen k. The, s- the story public. says um, the total was two hundred and twenty five thousand rands. Or for no, uh, that's what was outstanding for um Mapurisa. For, yeah for the promoters yeah because it's like 18 grand or something so what then happened with them is uh the police went to the hotel i think they had a uh, they had a writ of execution from the court right mm-hmm. and uh they were supposed to either arrest them or get the bucks uh so these guys i think their lawyer they negotiated that they pay the bucks but they pay them to, they pay the bucks to the court is because they want to pursue it. They they are not they are not saying uh, promoter here's the money. Yeah. They're saying court. This is security. We'll be back to fight this. You know? Oh, 
Yeah. It's not like, oh, here's your 18 What back. are you fighting? <laughs> you didn't perform. <laughs> yeah. So, um, so they want to pursue it or whatever. Is it not also the way we uphold our own artists? Yeah. Um, I don't know. There's just something. There's an allure about uh, having someone from somewhere coming to perform. So it can't be someone from Zimbabwe like, whoa. Support now, nah, because we're always in the club with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can come support. <laughs> and that's just Rimo. <laughs> yeah. You know, but when Rimo goes to South Africa, they appreciate him more. And, and I think with South Africa, uh, it's easier to bring a South African artist than it is to bring a Nigerian artist because Nigerians know dollars. Nigerians are more expensive. South Africans... Hey, but you know, this something... Are reasonable, but uh, they take us for granted now because they know... Um, in Zimbabwe, we like their music. Um, we need to push our own music, though. But that's what I was saying. Ka. Who do we need to uphold our own artists? Like if Nasha Katanga album, don't go support mm. Nasha when he goes. No, but to the his album thing. has to be nice, though. Yeah, yeah you just can't support the, but mediocre Nash, stuff. We're, we're, we're going back to the same yaya. Yeah. Very people who are producing really good music. Why are we not making noise about them and upholding them? It, but I that high I standard. Yeah. Yeah. Rimo. Rimo. Yeah. Rimo. 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 Yeah, and another uh, unfortunate incident. I don't know if you're following the whole uh, death and burial of Queen Elizabeth. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right. yeah. So everything was fine mm-hmm. until I discovered that there's world leaders and then there's African presidents. Oh, yes. Why would you go to a funeral where they're going to put you on a bus? Clearly, they don't no, want did you they there. know they were going to put you on a bus. They knew. Uh, there's, no. No way, there's no way you're going to leave your country and not Which know the not itinerary. No, yeah. no, 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 not, not the itinerary. These things, uh, on, some of these, on, the, on some of the clips of the, of the, bus, of the bus rides, right? even the, pr- the president of France was on the bus. They don't show you that. Oh, they was on, he? Yes, there are actually clips showing that he was actually on the bus. So Biden so, was so, the so, only one so, who so had that that make, No, there, there are only a few, I think maybe like six, seven presidents who were actually fussy, like the Chinese one, uh, Biden. Though that's a few who came My with their own leaders. Uh, My world leaders. My so, world leaders. So, 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 so France is here. No, I don't know they, why they, he they was... They spoke to the French guy and said, look, it's, it's, not, it's not, not looking good <laughs> on us. We <laughs> need a white dude on the bus so it looks okay. Yeah. You're the, you, he's the talking white guy. Yeah. He, uh, he said, I ah, know, don't worry, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take the four. Yeah. And, and that's why he was a, on the he's, bus. He's a pretty cool guy, anyway. He's, he's nice. How, how exciting is a funeral for you to want to go and be on a bus when you're used to a motorcade? Like, uh-huh. how exciting Recently are these funerals? Recently elected Kenyan president was on that bus. Huh? No hey. standing person. Just <laughs> <laughs> ah, no, but it's, it's, I think that's where it starts. Because if you can accept that, you can accept anything else. You want to go to my tati tachema or the queen or by you bought square go to some bus. Yeah, because I was. You know, there I'm be a lazy. Then when you would sing a foot, you know there. Because they're the colonizer, right? Yeah, she she you know represented. To what I'm be a lazy queen. She was doing her duty. You know, uh, as queen, she had. So, some so I have a problem with people putting up a, a status. Oh, right. R.I.P. Come on, queen. like what the fuck? Like, like the queen wasn't. Your queen like that. You know she was I mean? a human being. And you know, Zimbabweans, we also get too carried away. No. We've never posted our aunts have died. Uh, but it, I'm barely it, 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 Like, what the fuck is that? You know? No, but I mean... <laughs> Global leader. <laughs> no, but, no, no. That I mean, all our problems, you can trace it back to the monarch, right? You can trace all our problems to England. Colonization, all this stuff, all these problems of us having to retake our land and having to have people put us on sanctions and... You can all trace it back. If the queen and her people hadn't set off her people on ships to come and invade us. No, but they were saying Africans were barbaric and they needed some civilization. So they were coming. Who, barbaric to, to who? According to their standards. So you agree with their I'm, uh-uh. outlook, Becky? Excuse me. I'm, I'm just asking. No. But I'm just saying, okay, what we call uh, colonizing, for them, they saw it like it was okay. To, they to come it. to come and drive me off the land and no, then, they, and then, they and felt then, they felt very okay doing that. The slave trade and then ch- shackle us, put us on ships. You can go and poke them and say whatever it is that you want. What you did wasn't right. To them, 
what they did, it was okay. But what I'm saying is, like, you saw what Malema said. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, it, Malema. It was, it was very... Uh, he was out there, was like... very aggressive and, and what have you, but he has a point. Even Trevor Noah uh, put out yeah, something. Yeah, and, and, you know, people need to... Because this this is a turning point. Yeah, you I know, can't grieve like The death of the do, queen cause... must help us, you know, introspect. We must look at what she meant to us as You're a people. putting African presidents on the bus. Must be reflect. You understand, and then there's the Prince Charles and that g- black guy and that, who, yeah. Yeah, who tried <coughs> desperately to get a handshake, but was ignored. And also, you know, uh, I don't know if you guys read about uh, what's the William, Harry. Right? Harry, yeah. Harry. No, which one is no, no. Which one is the William. first one? William. No. Is so William. you know, William, right? Did you hear that he's having an affair? And the reason he is having an affair is because his wife refused to do. Pe- it's called pegging. You should know that. Where she wears a dildo. Please Google it. Someone Google it. William did what? <laughs> William, William likes, is the one next in line? Yeah. So, yeah, like after Charles so William likes William. to get fucked with uh, Dildo. So his wife refused to, to, to do that. Is that true though? Charles. No, no, Google it. Charles. Google it. Charles. Please. Charles. Google it. Google it. Now she's making stuff up. Bro. No, no, no. This, Google this it. Real? Google. Please, someone Google this. Is it going to come out on Guardian or, or some it's other? It's Google it. So apparently he's, uh, he's having an affair because his wife refused to do that. Please check this. Really? It, this so is the crazy. person he's having an affair with an uh, she, so it's called pegging, yeah, yeah. So she <laughs> she doesn't mind. But is this official, Nash? I'm telling. This is what's in the no, streets. No, no. There's always stuff on Google. No, no, if no, you no, Google no. stuff, but who is the person reporting the, the nyan? The, the guys are checking. The guys are checking. We have our new fake checker. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that, that's not a good look. It's um, not a good look. No, it's but then the kings having side items has always been a monarchy thing, and they were okay with it. But not being kinky like this. Like Asha, what you do behind your door, just, you know. Is it behind the door if Nash well, is Shasa bringing it up? Nash, Nash knows it. <laughs> Nash knows if I know it, everybody knows everybody it. Knows everybody knows it. Knows it. Uh, Check it out. Maybe, uh, it's, maybe, maybe it's going to come out. Speaking of the crown, um, uh, guys, if you haven't watched it, you, Danny, you need to just, yeah, you told me about just it, sit yeah. and watch. Um, if what they're depicting... On the crown is uh, anywhere close to what happened in real life. That monarchy is is just trouble. Yeah, and those diamonds, it's, they all it's, came from Zimbabwe. It's trouble. Well. Um, so on, what, on the crown. What I normally do is after watching an episode, I'll just further go and mind you. I'm on season two, episode two. Oh, sorry. Please. <laughs> the I'm queen enjoying is, it. The queen I'm is still cool. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm enjoying it still. <laughs> okay, let me know. Let yeah, me yeah. Um, okay. What I picked up um, is that they say it is an Englishman's duty to lay down his wife for the country. So if the king mm-hmm. or a future king likes your wife <laughs> it is an englishman's duty <laughs> to lay down his wife yeah that was that was the old rule the, the kings that's the old rule a king for you to get married right you, your king had to fuck your wife so <laughs> right? no no true hey, facts Nash, Nash, <laughs> come on. the law is there no 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 yeah, no we don't, we don't dispute that he had to lay no. with his wife lay <laughs> King, oh. King, King, oh. first time. Yeah. Just a quick one. Just a quick uh. one, Becky. Did you watch the... Uh, okay, you did watch the episode. Yes. You remember when the husband was complaining, good, ah, inam your toy. Oh, for, yeah. For yes, our relationship yes. to work, you need to put me as an heir. Was, uh, yes, uh, like, give me a title. Give, yeah, get, yes. yeah. So if the queen had died, was he going to be king? No, never. No, Do you know never. why? Uh, because uh, he's actually related to the queen, that guy. That We're talking vampire. about the crown. Yes. The, the vampire. Yeah. The, that guy got dead. Philip. Philip. Yeah, Philip. I never have him by the way. Okay, anyway. I'm lost. <laughs> no, no, remember, no. people used to call him the vampire because he looked like a vampire Can just before that. Yeah. I knew nothing of these people until I started watching the crown. Oh. Now, now goes that Queen Elizabeth. So, uh, this is really interesting to me because I'm learning a lot. Good to hey, those aren't you to get? Oh. Yeah. yeah, he moved from Duke to Prince. Yeah, from yeah. The, uh, Prince, and he's not uh, originally from England, right? No, from Greece. Greece, right, Greece. right, right. right. Danny, you need to watch that show, bro. So you were saying... I have no idea what you're talking about. So I was saying, uh, you, well, you, 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 you guys Netflix. were arguing with me about the pegging. Please read this article, Peggy. Okay. But but who's the, who's the source? Yeah, who's the source? I'll tell you who the source is. I'm going to read the okay, source. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Yes, but well, apparently... No, you know you got funny Twitter. sites that come up with funny stuff? 
Yes, you've got funny it's signs that come up, but there's no Is it Bloomberg? Is it CNN? No, 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 but it's, it's a thing that like, everybody knows about it in England, that she likes to get packed. Even in the, yeah, in the clubs, <laughs> they know she... Dara. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. I like That's how you say that so Queen easy. Queen Wakadu Mumtsi Uranyae. Kuna Wakadu Mumtsi Uranyae. Kuna Wakadu Mumtsi Uranyae. Oh, see, no, de, be, it's right there. Wana gogo. I don't have a phone. I don't have a phone. And you can't open network. So he's having an affair with what's This is from thecut.com. Prince of Pegging trends with a Prince William affair. Prince William was trending on Twitter yesterday, I think some months ago, in conjunction with a much more eye-catching hashtag that says, or that suggests Britain's future king is into pegging. Who's the source? Searches wow. for pegging went up four hundred percent. Like after people heard about Prince William's uh, fetish oh. with pegging, searches on Google. Mm-hmm. What, is what is pegging? If if, if, if a future king likes it, Peggy, we must get to know more. Chibabek, about it. Chibabek, so you're funny, you're not my search here pegging. Wow, well. well. VT. <laughs> Oh, that's not. Because if I don't like. Why do they have weird? I think I think when you grow up with everything, right? You get bored. You? you get bored. Like, what can I do? If you want to go to Paris, you want to go. You can do anything. You can buy anything. You just have everything. But that's <laughs> not <laughs> <laughs> I just have to Whoa. try it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Maja. So I'm not going to So his wife, his, his wife refused. refused. You said, "Are you fucking kidding me?" Crazy. <laughs> 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 I know, right? Uh, uh, the best wife said, this is, no, "This is crazy." Uh, then, uh, well, what's her, what's her name? Kate. Well, but but I don't know you mean. Kate. No, no, Kate, no, no, no. He's got he's got a new Rose, girlfriend. Rose Hanbury. Oh, Rose Hanbury. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 we oh. actually know the girlfriend. Yeah, Gaga. So Rose, imagine. <laughs> Rose, Gaga, yes. no problem. I'll do anything to find somebody. I'm going. She straps it on. She she pegs the guy. Yeah. Is it Ronaldo? Yeah. She pegs the guy. It's a dildo you put on. It's a dildo. Yeah. It's like it's like what uh, you know like. Let's be honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine, you know, imagine. What you thinking? Imagine. <laughs> so why, why can't he just get a guy then? No, 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 because then no. He's uh, so, he's not. So th- I think I think <laughs> right. Dara was reading and then I think low key you have to be gay to like that. Of course, you know what I mean. Right. Yeah. Because yeah, if you, if you can take a dildo, surely. How, yeah. Uh, I mean. I mean. You know, low. next thing is you're taking the real thing. But right, I mean, yeah. I w- I'm look. I'm applying for a visa for UK. Let me stop now. <laughs> 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 what were you saying about the future, Kate? <laughs> hey, stop now. Just yeah. thank God your face is not showing. Yeah. Mm. Otherwise. So, but anyway, yeah. Yeah. So uh, apparently, we have breaking news. Yeah, uh, we were talking about uh, the whole promoter and artist DJ issue drama uh, on the DJ Maporisa one. So I'll read mm. it here from Point. We just, we just got news in while we're shooting? Um, and it's dated today. And today is... Uh, no, this is... Yeah. What's today? Wednesday. This yes. is dated today, right? We're shooting on Wednesday. The episode is out on Thursday, I think. Yeah. So God willing and... Ba- <laughs> <laughs> Bako Bako. willing. <laughs> God willing and Bako willing. <laughs> this will be out and it won't be stale news. Um, the second respondent uh, will uh, and is hereby ordered to immediately pay back to applicants or their nominated agents the sum of eighteen thousand four hundred US dollars, uh, with which applicants had paid uh, pursuant um, to the right of execution in writ. matter. Is it writ? Mm-hmm. Oh yes, it is. Sorry. Um, pursuant to um, to the writ of execution in matter number, and then they <laughs> state the matter number, the first respondent shall pay the cost of suit on attorney and client scale. Wow. wow 
That's so, crazy. <laughs> so, so um, DJ Mapurisa and their lawyers paid 18.5 to the court and as security or whatever. And then the and then that allowed them to go. Then the guys left for South Africa. And then the lawyer then pursued it, I think, in court. And said, uh-uh. And said, no, this is unprocedural, <laughs> whatever, whatever, whatever. I don't know what the code was. So the court has judged that they must um, uh, give Mapurisa and them their money back. And then they must also pay. They must also pay uh, the legal costs. Yes. So on top of paying back the eighteen thousand four hundred. That is messed up for Zimbabwean promoters. Uh, I don't. I, I don't know much about you, the you judgment. One of those you me. Yeah, but I was. I was happy that people are being made to um, to account for stuff. You know, you can't just get booked, and then and then and then not appear. Do you think the promoter is going to continue pursuing this? I think they will. I think this is... Uh, this is too much back in I, I, I don't know if they'll be able to maybe uh, do an agent application to... Is it rescind this order? I don't know. I, I'm not a legal guy. I think uh, what happened but was um, this lawyer... Lawyer the, Kapinga, the lawyer is G. Mm. Yeah, uh, because he just said, no, no, let, let's court. release this money so you're able to go. And then uh, Dosaran G. Sota. Adam system. Yeah. And then it took him 24, 48 hours. He's definitely in the system. He knows what he's doing. Mm. So 40 hours, so they're getting their money back. So uh, <coughs> DJ Mapurisa and Kabza have won this one so far. Yeah. But uh, as a promoter, Danny, would you continue with this? Yonzoi. 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 Well, yeah, yeah. Well, you're still, I'm still odd. I mean, you, 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 um, I, I still went through these inconveniences because of, of you. Um, so if I paid your hotel, the hotel is not going to give me back the money. If no, I it's paid. Not. So, you know, so um, I think they will fight on. It's just like a temporary relief for these guys. But I think the case is still there. But someone's got to do a manifest to tank wrap up. Some money issue. So, so at some point, they, yeah, but at some point, they're going to have to handle it because this guy is going to still pursue it. And I think he might get another writ of execution for the next time they are coming. You think so you, you probably just don't want ah, that. Over. I mean, we are, we are their biggest market, though. Ah, we like no, them. It's true. <laughs> I'm saying it to you, like, they will come back. I mean, I mean the, the 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 girls, the girls, they came. Can I tell you something? <laughs> the TXC girls. No, no but no, no one knew that Nyaya. Yeah. I I I don't think if anyone really knew the first TX TXC Nyaya, mm. so, they so, would have been so, called a second time. So are we saying maybe the next time somebody tries to book them, we're like, ah, we ain't coming there. No, this this uh, let's wait for Zambia. Let's no, wait no for they said they said we're never coming back to this country. Ever. Country, country, yeah. And it's okay. Oh. Yeah. And I, I don't think we'll die if they don't. Yeah, die. we got Nati O. Yeah, yeah. The we DJ Remo. DJ yes. Remo. Yeah. So Chaga, we do a scanner. Mm. So now my baby, my baby, my baby. Yes. They're not doing anything special, though. True. They just got a nice hype. They just hype. look good. Yeah. It's got the a nice aesthetics. Hype to them. It's the aesthetics. Yeah, we got lots of beautiful girls. And, and also those girls, they're actually very slim, huh? Mm. So it's not like we're, we're, we don't have slim girls. <laughs> they're not the sexiest <laughs> girls. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we've brought a lot of... Uh, Female DJs for yeah. them to yeah. complain good hey, security, ETC, yeah. this and that. Mm -hmm. What waffles has come, no problem. Mm. TDK has come. A lot of female artists yeah. have come. And no problem. No, no problem. problem. But with them, specifically them, why? Yeah. Why always you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Why always you? There's then there's that one and the um social media. Uh it's like I don't know whether to call it uh, a testosterone battle or... A what? Testosterone. Testosterone? I can't even pronounce that myself, so Becky... Testosterone. Uh, Becky, I have no problem. Carry on. Okay, because <laughs> I was like, did I say yeah, something you wrong? You said Tete. I, I said Tete. Yeah. Oh, no, why would I say... You know why? You're going to play back? You, because you speak Debele. You mentioned Debele, you are a tribe. I know Remo definitely is not, guys. Remo definitely is not. I can't even pronounce. Testes. You know, test, 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 what? Remo can't test, even, test, can't even pronounce okay. testing rice. <laughs> <laughs> testing rice. Okay, that, <laughs> that, that, that male hormone yes, thing that going on. Bako. Or is it, uh, <laughs> or is it just Shadaya <laughs> happening? <laughs> is it what? Or is it just another Shadaya <laughs> post <laughs> thing happening? <laughs> Did we talk about Shadaya? No, no, that's why I'm saying there's that, that tea battle. <laughs> 
Yes. Or is it just Shadaya being Shadaya? Can I can I also uh, that's in that story? Yes, because okay, now he's go, now he's not okay. He's subliminally going for the women, mm-hmm. but directed to the men. But he's always been going for the women. Yeah, but this normally he's very direct mm-hmm. to women. Nah, 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 nah. But this time he's like Danny J. Agadai was so because Agadai was so. Oh, K. Chaps, Baba Harare. Yes. Yeah. Um, is that Shadai just being? Sh- I don't know. You guys spoke n- to him. Yeah, I've no, no. Shadai is being Shadai. Yeah, that is very Shadai. That, him. Uh, he's just a real nigga like that. Mm. He's, he's being real. Uh, it's, tr- uh, it's not lying. So the, this last post was Wait, what? Was lying. about uh, what was the last post about? <laughs> uh, <laughs> hold on, Danny. <laughs> hold on. Yeah, uh, where is he? I don't want to be Shadai. Look, Papi Pacho. Can I be honest? It's just a doctor, Becky. Uh. I'll tell you why. Just as he just doesn't know how to. If it was Danny, <clears throat> if it was Danny explaining to women are like this, men like this, he knows the appropriate way of no, but, saying it. But so, he, oh, he you're saying Danny says knows women, he's Shadai brash. doesn't. Ah, uh, 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 he's got point him. Oh, <laughs> is that a shot? <laughs> it's got a point him. That is Shadai, 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 Right, yeah. but uh. he just doesn't know how to address it to people. I, all, right. I did it. all right, what's the latest, latest one? Uh, Nash, tell us um, what, what did they say? You Yama can't say? Uh, marry a girl who's not a virgin, basically. It, you, you can't just, play so, in other words, you, you, you can't, can't marry, yeah, <laughs> right? Yeah, because there's no, but Hansi, it's got something to do with it, says something about what you think of your man. No, I think it's, it's got something to do with the lobola to say what the lobola is to thank the parents for a virgin. I think. Virgin. Virgin. Yeah, something like that. But, but then that you see my point is, right? But even mm-hmm. even uh, Angel, then you saw Angel's post, right? You, Hubert Angel. Oh, no, no, I didn't. What, uh, where it? people, um, they posted on Simcelebs mm-hmm. saying, Kuti, Anzi, um, Hubert Angel is supporting what Shadai says about uh, marrying a virgin woman. Okay. Yeah, you, you actually need to see it. Okay. I don't agree mm-hmm. personally. So, so, so he's saying you bet angel or oh guy. You bet angel. He's saying don't pay lobola if the chick is, is already, already yeah. She, yeah, she's already. Been so if she's already been child, don't pay lobola. Just so we are. So there'll be very few people paying lobola. I wish, I wish you. I wanted you to show. I wanted you to see that clip where he specifically says he said something. Um, you bet angel. Try look for the clip, Danny. Oh right. Um. <coughs> hey, so so we might need to have Shadai back, right? What? I, w- I would we, like, yeah. Uh, we had we had agreed on 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 a comeback, and then uh, things happened, and um, we had a misunderstanding. But at some point, we're gonna have to reconnect. You had a misunderstanding Shadaya, with who? With Shadaya. Oh, um, about how he wanted us to do it. But oh, right, right. But right. I think um, I think the impact that Shadaya had on the show, uh-huh. and the impact that the show had on Shadaya, at some point, I think we have to. Um, to another episode, right, Nash? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, remember, I remember what he said. I remember what he said. Okay, he was what like, did he say? He was like, um, how can you marry someone that when you when you meet up with your friends, and the innocent, ah, uh, but oh, in, yeah, 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 I saw, saw that, that one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What he was saying, yeah. I mean, you know. But that cancels out a lot of women. A lot. Not true. Not true, sir. True, so true. But he, he, he wasn't talking about the Lobola part. He was just saying, yeah, it's not nice for me yeah. to marry a woman yeah. who everyone has been with, yeah. type thing. Okay, you know what I'm but saying? But that's yeah. different from what Shadai Yeah, yeah, is. it's, it's mm. kind of different. Like um, what what he's saying, honestly, that is so true. I yeah. mean, my dad even used to yeah. raise me yeah. like that. Would yeah. you please? Mm. But Shadai would live when he was na ngiri nwan fano ta free or fano but that one. Those are basically that's what he's saying, right? Is his girlfriend a virgin? What What do you think, Danny? What do you think about it? About what? About what Shadai said? What do you think? Uh, I President, think, I, no, I, I, I don't think it, it makes sense because uh, a lot of people when they marry someone, mm-hmm. they're not marrying them for the virginity, right? Uh, they're marrying them for the person, right? Like, like other qualities. Yeah, other qualities. Maybe um, you um, c- 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 enhance me. Mm-hmm. You because I make feel me complete. If, if it's got nothing to do with the virginity. I don't yeah. think so. So if Lobola was about virginity, then. Uh, Isha. Because I feel Lobola Lobola is a token of respect. Appreciation. appreciation. Sorry, appreciation Mm. uh, for Mm. giving me your daughter. Mm, and it. nothing to do with the virginity. No, no, nothing to do with the virginity. Is a bonus. Yeah, it's, okay, it's, it's a bonus. Yeah. It's a bonus. Yeah, yeah. but um, that's that's that's. Yeah. Yeah. So I think about I went over the top like he, you know, he does. <laughs> like he does. Our guy, our guy. Yeah, you know, our guy is extra. I do follow his posts. Like, I do but, read. But and he has a lot of. He has a lot of depth. He has a lot of depth. He says some really uncomfortable stuff, but a lot of it is true. 
That's mm. what I'm saying. A lot of it is true. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Very brashly presented. Mm. But no, true. But he says he's not out there to be politically correct. He just true. wants to mm. say what he's But I, I think his understanding of why people pay Lobola, I, I think it might be it might not be correct. My question is the girl he's dating currently, what if when what if he discovers Kuti she's not a girlfriend? I mean a, a, a virgin. That he's going Maybe he already isn't. knows he's not going to marry her. Yeah. Also, he already knows. What about Chila? Maybe he knows. But then he also shuns guys who just Chila. <laughs> like, what does he want them to do? What does he Yeah, like. No, I'm, I'm, we're going to have to bring him But I, s- I just sometimes feel like Shadaya just posts these things so people can talk. Like yeah, it's good for it's, it's good for his yeah. brand. It's, yeah. it's good yeah. for him to stay relevant. There's so many controversies. Like, get you thinking. Yeah. Yeah. But sure. No, but for real, on mm. a real. I think he, he he does yeah, it so point. that. But, and, and he also says a lot of stuff that guys can't say, and then it's easy for but him guys to post. And then I say, "Yo, Shadaya, my man." Like my man. Like baby, baby, baby. What is it? What is it? What he says? Because you just go behind over over the little thing. What do you think, my guy? Like Shadaya. When I point, that's my girlfriend. Uh, yes, mm. when I point, just say something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, um, oh God. yeah, so it, it'll be cool if we have him back on the show. It'll be a very different show from the one that we have with him. Because we have a, a, a Becky who. Becky I mean, I, I, I won't mind talking to him. I've mm. got a few questions. Ah, nice. Yeah, not like. Okay. But but also but you want to understand. But yeah, but I do. And like after you've said what you said, what do you want us to do then as women? What's the <laughs> what you want us to do? Yes, what's the correctional um mm. way of thinking that but you why okay. does it have to come from Shadai? No, because he's the one who brings up the I issues. Okay, I won't do the but you, you, you keep bashing me. Uh, okay, so, so what's, say, what's the correct way? Hey, oh, what's okay. the correct way? Okay, uh, and yeah. <laughs> I'm all over the shore. Sakandoita say, say, does it mean I'm no longer counted amongst society? How can I purify myself? Thank you. Yes, Yes, just Ah, that. ah, If you're going to bash, give me a solution. Rebecca, stop drinking water. Stop drinking this water. Mm. Rebecca, stop drinking. Okay, Sakandoma, and then I can make my decision Ah. if I want to continue drinking that water or something else. I I get your point. Yeah, because he never gives us that. So he he just attacks, he never gives the solution. He never gives the solution. All right, so so you want him to come and then he. Yeah, because he's mentioned areas of my life where I'm like, whoo, that's me. Mm. And I'm like, yo, that is so me. <laughs> oh my gosh. But then I'm now a married woman and I've got my family, I've got my household. But what about someone who didn't get to my point? Right. Mm-hmm. What about someone who What didn't? do they do? Mm. What do they do? Because then I rectified myself and I was like, girl, you need to <laughs> get your shit together. Chimbo and slower down. Chimbo yeah, Jimbo, slower down. down. <laughs> but it was a conscious decision that, that I made for myself. Right. And then along comes Shaddai. This is years later in my life. And I'm, re- I'm reading his comments. And I'm like, Do okay, you know? <laughs> this man is talking about what I was yeah, like. Yeah, I'm not yeah. that person anymore. anymore. Yeah. But the way he does it, it makes it feel like there's no hope whatsoever. Just go and look for a corner yeah. and die. So, so is there some truth from what you've seen, some of his stuff? Shad- okay, let's, let's put it this way. Shaddai does not lie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, true. And then Shaddai does not lie. But his his delivery just makes you feel like which there's no why, hope. Which is why I was saying yes. the way he addresses it. Makes it he yeah. makes you feel like it's that, the end of the world. <laughs> just uh, mm. just <laughs> wait to die. Just wait to die. And that's not true. It's not the end of the world. Many girls have been through the most true. and they've come out tops. Yeah, true. Yeah. True. Yeah. What is it, Jerry? Cool. Um, no, nothing big. So. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> So, so much for insight. that reason, I would like him back. All right, so much insight. Uh, Shadaya, Becky K wants you back on the show. Please. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. So uh, I, Shadaya Banoya, please. You're a good guy. By the way, understand. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have anything against you. No, 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 I know that, but I'm yes. just saying. We for me, that's what you got. I'll, I'll even come with a notebook. Yeah. I'll mm. even come with a notebook. Mm. I said, oh, okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah. Beautiful show. <laughs> Beautiful show. We spoke about tribalism. Oh, gosh. We spoke about the queen. We spoke about DJ Baburisa. We spoke about DJ Remo. Um, what didn't we speak about? We spoke about Shadaya. We, we pretty much spoke about everything. We didn't speak about uh, DJ Remo's groupies. Okay. 
Mm. You, got, you got those? <laughs> yeah, I'm not because Remo. All right, so, so in conclusion, in we conclusion, have to talk about Remo, the, I mean, please, I mean, what's your what, what's your day like? <laughs> I mean, well, what are your DMs like? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Before he does that, I want to just a moment in Remo's head. Yeah. Mm. So you woke up this morning and you were like, obviously I'm going to see some people, I'm going to do some stuff. No, I'd beg you. Wait, no, I, no. Uh-uh. Can I? Okay. Mirror this. first. There's got to be a mirror. He looks oh, no. in the mirror. Oh, I'm getting, are you, you are here. Yeah. You are here. Like, no, you are there. Like, right? like, and you're like, I'm going to see some people. Right. Okay, there's going to be cameras. Blah, blah, blah. And then after that, obviously, I don't know what you're going to do after this. And then you opened your wardrobe. And you mm-hmm. were like, that's the shirt. Right. Ha, that pimp shirt right there. <laughs> <laughs> Joe <Joy> Exotic. <laughs> yeah, <did it. laughs> if your hair had movement, if your hair had movement, I'm sure yeah, there was there's some gel thing going on and then the on the eyebrow thing. <laughs> and then what's the words that you say to yourself before you leave the house? Let's go get him, Rimo. <laughs> hey. You you go boy. You, you go <laughs> boy. Uh, 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 so to all the viewers out there, my typical morning starts off like this. I wake up at um, six o'clock. The first person on my mind is my daughter. Okay. This is Remo, not Instagram stripper bay Remo. Okay. I do school run, right? And think like every other normal person, how am I getting paid today? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So have I answered your question, babe? No. <laughs> you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You didn't do the whole thing with the beard. Yeah. I got, I got, I got an interview. You. I, don't, no, I don't do you, that. You, okay, mm. sorry, you look the type. Really? Yeah. Are you saying Rima is a slay king? <laughs> <laughs> is there something like that? Yeah. Do you know... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Think about it. Give it to us. Give it to us. We. No, no, no. You don't do that. No, not at all. No. I think I'm too grown for that. No, <laughs> No, please. I think I'm too grown. Look, I humbled myself to come and greet you. Ooh. Again with the humbling Honor. yourself. He is so humble. I'm so humble. I mean, look, I came to greet you. Yes, you did. You're and just thank having. You. What is it? Lunch. You're having lunch. Yes. I have yes, a nest. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> that was the Danny J okay, show. Okay, sorry, we've before we close what? the Danny J show, how, yeah. how, how, how can I make it up to you? I'm sorry. No, I, so I forgive sure. you. You're, oh, you're, sure. you're part of the team. You, you know <laughs> not what you do. Yeah. <laughs> you're forgiven. Oh, wow. You're forgiven. <laughs> you're forgiven. <laughs> no, Vare. Oh, Nindi Vare. All right. And that's it from the Danny J show. Coming with Becky K. And we had Urimo Jackson in the building. <laughs> Until next time. <laughs> So yeah, yeah, yeah. The Danny J Show. Shanga <laughs> Shiri down to up to right things we. Nyaza to this narrative, die cheat we. Kanam chida deep is a deep, die pit we. Nick.